I am very nervous about this. A thing that terrifies me is apparently there are still some financial institutions that will accept a voice print as authentication for you to like move a lot of money or do something else. You say a challenge phrase and they just do it. Um, that is a crazy thing to still be doing. Like AI has fully defeated that. AI has fully defeated most of the ways that people authenticate currently other than like passwords, but all of these like fancy, you know, take a selfie and wave or do your voice or whatever. Um, I am very nervous that we have an impending, a significant impending fraud crisis because of this. Um, we have tried, I think other people in our industry have tried to sort of warn people like, hey, just because we're not releasing the technology doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Some, some bad actor is going to release it. This is not a super difficult thing to do. This is coming very, very soon. Um, and, you know, there's obviously some reports now of these sort of like ransom attacks where people have the voice of your kid or your parent and they make this urgent call. Um, that is going to get so compelling. Society has to deal with this problem more generally, but people are going to have to change the way they interact. They're going to have to change the way they verify, like this person calling me. Right now it's a voice call. Soon it's going to be a video FaceTime. It'll be indistinguishable from reality. Um, and teaching people how to authenticate in a world like that, how to think about you know, the, the fraud impacts, this is a huge deal.